Buen Eve Digital Family, how are we doing? I am here with Andrew Palau. You remember when we had him last time? It was like a couple of months ago and he was telling us, you know, there's this festival we're planning in September. Well, here we are, the visionary for Love Nairobi Festival. And it's good to talk yeah. to you again, Andrew. Good to be back, Tess. We love Kenya. Karibu Jumbo. Tena. <laughs> I, I saw you the other day with some list of Swahili words. Yeah, Do you have, I have them? them all right here. <laughs> and I'm good too. <laughs> Oh, but I lost it. <laughs> I, I, I was teaching him to say nakupenda, na nakupenda. <laughs> nawapenda. I and love he, you. <laughs> and he was like, let me write that. Yeah. Let me write that. Habari that zenu. <laughs> Please say hello to everybody yeah. that's going to watch this and just a bit about oh, yourself. <laughs> thank you for tuning in. And I hope you're blessed and encouraged right now today. I hope you'll come to the festival. We'll talk all about it. But you don't have to wait for the festival to let the Lord speak to you and encourage your heart. He is near to you. So mm -hmm. bless you today. Mm -hmm. Let's talk a little bit about how this was born. I know this yeah. fe festival happens in all, all cities around uh, Africa, even beyond. But for Nairobi, how did that happen? Well, you know, we it's all about relationships. Mm -hmm. So we've been doing these festivals around the world for my dad did it before me. So almost 60 years. Yeah. I've been going for 30. And so... Uh, you know, just through friendships, some of the bishops came to uh, Yamasukro and they came to Abidjan and they came and observed what we did in Blantyre. Yeah. And so as they saw it, they really began to feel this is the right model for this time for Kenya. So yeah. we agreed and prayed and started looking at the timing. We were trying to do it in 2020, but then COVID came mm -hmm. and then we knew 22 would be the elections, right? Yeah. So we said, okay, I guess it's 23. So we really decided to do it many years ago. And that's allowed us to go further and deeper in friendship and, yeah. and in impact. So mm -hmm. we're very happy. And now is the time. It's the time. Uh, yeah. And, and people need, we need to get together. Yeah. Right. We were kind of <laughs> separated in various ways. There's a lot of uncertainty and the world is still full of troubles, but uh, that's why we need to come together and mm. celebrate and worship the Lord. Yeah. And, Let's talk a little bit about some of the ministers. We just were talking to Pompey. Yeah. Don Moyne is going to be coming as well. Christ Safari. Uh, yeah. Tell us a bit ab about some of your expectations yeah. before we can take a look at some of the Kenyan ministers. We really want it to be a joyful celebration. Mm. So it's a full-blown gospel music festival so that you can bring out the family. There's things for the children, the extreme sports. And the purpose of all that is just so that you can uh, just... Warmly welcome the entire city. You're all welcome to come. There's something for everybody. And it's the joy of the Lord, you know. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit different, but the heart is the same. We want to encourage people about the fact that Jesus Christ has transformed our lives. Yeah. And we are sure he will do for you what mm -hmm. he has done for us. Mm -hmm. So we want to share with you that message and give you the opportunity to respond. Yeah. And just receive that healing and wholeness and soundness of mind that you've been searching for. And uh, we'll describe to you how it's happened in our lives. All the music is part of it. The worship. Mm, yeah. Everybody's gifts together. Yeah. So please come. Yeah. Well, let's talk a little bit about the name. And then maybe we yeah. could just uh, mention some of the artists that will be here. Love Nairobi yeah. Festival. What does that mean? Uh, you were talking a lot about the love of God. The last time we yeah. hung out on air, you were very passionate just to yeah. share and saying people need to experience the love of God. Yeah. So Love Nairobi Festival. Yeah, yeah. A little bit about that. Yeah. God says Nawapenda. We should have called it the <laughs> Nawapenda Festival. Uh, but it, it really just brings everything right to the foundation of what God says to us. I love you. I created you. I have a purpose and a plan. Um, you know, he, ever since sin entered the world and uh, things have gotten sideways and we're all part of it. But uh, he says, I still love you and I'm calling you and I still have a way for you in this world. You know, mm -hmm. the Bible says the thief comes to steal, to mm -hmm. kill and destroy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to talk about this on Saturday. Yes. But I've come to give you life and life in abundance, you mm -hmm. know. Um, and everything he's done is, is an expression of his desire to let you know that he wants to be in relationship with you like, mm -hmm. a, like a proper, uh, like he says, I'm your father. Yeah. I will make you my child. So if you have a bad situation in your family that might not make sense but if you think of the father that you longed for mm. the father that you should have been yourself uh, but there is the heavenly father the, the good father and he wants to embrace you and bring you into the family make you his child and then put you on his path uh, the abundant life a life worth living and you might say my life is dark mm. I don't know if it's worth it it's worth it when you uh, put your uh, life in the hands of Jesus mm. he loves you and you know he said um, the festival is a way for us to show we love each other. Yes. Right? He says, 
they will know you're my followers by your love for one another. Yes, so that's why we're another. coming together too, is just yeah. to say, we want the world to know we have differences and there's different names on churches. Mm -hmm. You may wonder why is why are we all, why are those churches all separated from each other? Well, we're not, we just have to keep things organized. Really, under the banner of Jesus Christ, yeah. we love each other tremendously. That's, that's awesome. So. Well, you mentioned something to do with uh, relationships and networking, and I saw that uh, Love Nairobi Festival, a lot of the Fathers of Faith have been involved. Yeah. How was that, uh, just yeah. getting to come and oh, involve them? What a privilege, you know, and they love each other, <laughs> but they have heavy burdens day in and day out. They carry the weight of the world uh, on our behalf. They train us, they teach us, they shepherd us. They deal with all our stuff, you know? And, uh, and, and yet they, they still have that higher vision for the city to do something special. Hmm. So what an honor to work with the great leaders of your city. They've all sacrificed a lot because they've believed in this vision. We're just like the grease between the wheels, you know? Yeah. The heart of this thing is the body of Christ mm -hmm. together. Not even them. Yes. It, it, it's all the of the body, body of Christ together. But what, what a good uh, group of leaders are here. And we really are believing the best is yet to come for mm. Kenya. Mm. Well, for uh, somebody that's watching and they're going to come to the festival, uh, maybe uh, for, for you, what would, tell, what would you tell them in terms yeah. of what to expect? Well, if Apart you, from good music, great yeah. music, good <laughs> news. Uh, you know, there's something for everybody. Go online, uh, look at the websites or on Facebook and see the schedule. Make sure... The children are there for the children's area mm. uh, on Saturday and Sunday. And then all three days, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, you'll see the uh, extreme sports. You don't want to miss that. It's a world-class sporting event right here at the University mm. Grounds in Kenya. I mean, these are the top national skaters, BMX bikers, freestyle motocross. They're jumping there and they're going to share their story. Mm. They're ministers. Mm. And uh, it's a good e expression that whatever gifts God's given you, you can use them for the Lord. Yeah. And then the music. And then I pray, I pray you'll come with a prepared heart and bring a friend, you know, mm. in particular, don't come alone. Yeah. Bring people out. It's such a joyful moment. You will be so sorry if you don't bring out the neighborhood, but if you're spiritually seeking, that is really the purpose of the festival. Yes. We want people to find the spiritual answers that they're looking for. They're here in the Bible. We're going to share our stories. Mm. And uh, uh, if you're struggling, Maybe you've known the Lord in the past, but you've wandered off and you wonder, is it too late for me? You come and let's stand together and think that through and pray about it. It's not too late for you. Yeah. Uh, God loves you and he's calling you back. Amen. Maybe, you've, maybe you're from a different background. You're welcome. Uh, you've been curious about Jesus. Maybe you've had dreams and he's visited you in the night and he's uh, called you and you wonder, what do I do? Come to the festival. We'll, we'll talk about it. We'll introduce you to the living God there mm. and, and your life will be transformed. You'll you can receive that healing that you need. Amen. Uh, and, and spiritually, you'll come alive. Amen. That's what it's all about. Amen. So this is a surprise. Uh, Andrew can tell us more details, yeah. but something is cooking. Yeah. Is it on Sunday? Oh, there's surprises each day, but especially <laughs> I urge Sunday. you don't miss Sunday. On Sunday. <laughs> I know you're going to go to church, some of you. Uh, but don't forget to bring your friends. Maybe th those that don't go to church, come because it's going to be like a high, a high finale. Yes, high finale. Pompey, Christ Safari, Don Moen, Jabidi, Moji, Evelyn Wanjiru, Masi Masika. Guys, it's going to be an amazing, amazing time. Love Nairobi Festival is happening. This is Bonif Digital. We'll tell you all about it if you miss it, but we pray that you don't. So we'll see you next time. God bless you.